Hey guys, this is Coral and welcome to another weekly update video of World of Custom Statues. If you are interested in any of the pieces mentioned in the video, just send me a message on the social media platform links in the description below. Also, if you want to see more photos, just check out the description as well. I got one of these very rare crouching Spider-Man. It's only the blue-red version. It comes with three portraits. It is also ready to ship, so just hit me up if you are interested. Got one of the best Doctor Doom on Throne available. This one is also ready to ship. Uh, photo is not mine by the way, I just got them from Coracell, but it is the statue that you will be getting. Got one of these Del Otto Spider-Man. This is a sold out piece and quite rare in my opinion. I actually have this in my collection too. Just hit me up if you're interested in this one. Got two of these Sosa Supermans available. Uh, this is quite rare and actually quite expensive. So hit me up if you're interested. Got one of these very rare Infinity Venom available. I think this is the only one around with the Infinity Gauntlet for Venom. Anyway, the portraits are quite fun in my opinion. Doesn't take much space to display as well. Got this Sosa Black Panther ready to ship, very comic accurate and has a very small footprint so it's easy to display. Hit me up if interested. Got one of these Cyborg Hulk ready to ship. This is a sold out piece and it is sculpted by Caleb Nefsen. Just hit me up if you are interested. We have the full reveal for the prototype of this Venom vs Carnage. This is a piece for Venom fans, not so much for Carnage since Carnage is almost defeated or actually already defeated here. We have the prototype reveal for this museum type Iceman. Gotta say this is very very impressive and definitely tempted to get this one. Small base and a great statue. This Venom is ready to ship. This is a companion piece to a Spider-Man with a similar type of base and now it also be a companion piece to a symbiote Spider-Man version. No more waiting time for this one except for shipping. This statue comes with a whooping eight portrait switch outs by the way and half of the base is removable so if you want to display him lower, you can do so. We got the full reveal for an invincible statue. This is the first one from the studio and we have Alan the alien. Don't know much about the show but the scope looks amazing, it's very promising and would be a really cool line to complete. We have the prototype reveal for this Gunslinger spawn. This diorama definitely came out amazing. It will be the best Gunslinger for sure. Also comes with some crazy switchouts and even a stand to display all these switchouts. We got some new renders for this Kratos on Throne by Caleb. As most of you know, Caleb renders are like black and white. So here are more realistic renders with colors. So you get a better understanding on what the statue would actually look like. Next, we have this M. Bison on Throne. Probably the best Street Fighter statue around. He is ready to ship, still has some stocks available, so just hit me up if you are interested. We got some work in progress on the prototype of this Gladiator Logan. Reveal will most likely be soon, just some small tweaks. We got this Cyclops vs Sentinel by Caleb Nepsen finally printed. Soon the prototype will be revealed. The prototype will most likely be painted by Titinun uh, since she has painted all the other X-Men that are on this line.
got one of this Deadpool that was sculpted by Franco Carlissimo. This is ready to ship. Just hit me up if you are interested. We got the prototype reveal for this Gambit that is actually sculpted by Caleb. And wow, the color really pops. The clear resin to emphasize his powers looks amazing. Very small base as well, so very easy to display. It actually comes with two bases. And of course, the light up features just to make it even cooler. We got the full reveal for the cell shading prototype of this Mr. Sinister. Really looks like it came out of the comics or from the show. Looks very promising but I can't wait for the normal version prototype to be completed. We have this Weapon X that is ready to ship. This is sculpted by no other than Franco Carlissimo. It's very rare actually that I get to feature statues that are sculpted by him since they are very, very exclusive. So I got the version 1 and version 2 of this Weapon X. The version 2 has two leg option and both version will have three portraits and metal claws. We got the full reveal of this invisible woman as well as the Mr. Fantastic statues. Both paint came out amazing, definitely matches the Johnny Storm before it. The clear resin on the base looks really cool to showcase the invisible woman's uh, power force fields. And of course, the torso stands so nothing gets left in the box for both statues. Really love the pose on Mr. Fantastic as well. Very dynamic and shows the power of Mr. Fantastic too. We got the full reveal and open pre-order for this Ultimate Jim Lee Storm. Comes with two versions to choose from, either you go with the silver or the white version. You'll get four portraits and two sets of arms for the statue. The Yellow Thunder will be optional or removable, so don't worry if you don't feel like displaying them. Also, small update on the sculpt. There are some changes on how the legs will go to the base, so it'll be more stable. We have the prototype reveal for the Spider Gwen, probably the most beautiful Spider Gwen out there. Titino did a fantastic job on the prototype as usual, especially the base. Very, very nice call for sure, so don't miss out on this Spider Gwen. We have the full reveal and open pre-order for this symbiote Spider-Man. Sachi will come in two portraits and two left hands, so you get to choose if you want to display him full on uh, symbiote Spider-Man or with a portrait and left hand transformation switch out. We have a very big sale for some selected statues. All of the statues in the photos are available till of course stocks last. Socks are very limited in case you are wondering, so just hit me up if you are interested. This project is up and running again and we have the print of the Superman by Jim Lee. This is only the quarter scale. We are not sure yet if the one third will happen. But anyway, in case you forget, here are some renders of the Jim Lee Superman. We got the prototype reveal for this carnage and it is done by Titinon and of course she did an amazing job as always. Love the base on this carnage and how aggressive carnage looks. Quite unique base as well compared to all the sideshow or XM bases for carnage. We got the full reveal for both the prototype of this Doctor Doom on there. Now we have the God Doom version as well. This is gonna be a massive statue so be ready for that. This is gonna be as massive as throne statues actually.
got two teasers for you guys this week. First is an upcoming penguin. Uh, no, this is just a teaser, not the actual animal penguin, but the Batman villain penguin. Next is a new Mr. Sinister will be coming. Again, every information you need will be in the description below. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on future updates. And if you're looking for a different video to watch, you should check out this video right here. This is Carl and see you again next week.